Howdy guys, this is Geesquad16. Welcome back to Let's Play Mario Tennis. Today, we're going to play as everyone's favorite ape, Donkey Kong. I was going to say King Kong, but no, that's a different character. Okay guys, let's do the EK's run. And I don't know who his partner is. We'll find out right here. It's going to be Toad. Okay, yeah, Toad. Toad and DK, what a pairing. And we got Luigi and Baby Mario to start things out. Okay, we're not doing too good right now. It's not good. Come on, Toad! Get in there, there we go. Oh, come on! There you go. Get, you gotta get it away from Luigi now, Toad. There we go. That's how we do it. There we go. There we go. Change All right, so now let's do this. Yeah, Donkey Kong. Remember, he has that power, and his serves and his serves, and especially his power shots are are pretty pretty doggone good. Hit him with such force. Dang it! Wow. There we go. 1530. Nope. Ah! Wow. Actually taking it to us. There we go, that's gonna... Okay, freaking finish this, wow. And this is only the first match of the Mushroom Cup. Mario just stood, maybe Mario just like stood there and it's like, uh, really? Instead of waiting and waiting, it hits the ball. <laughs> that's funny. Okay, we got Paratrooper and Wario for this one. So get away from him. There you go. That's what you're supposed to do. I think when we had uh, Baby Mario, that speed character. Okay, there we go. Now it's now we're getting our rhythm. There we go. I think Toad's technique, though. Yeah, that's the that's the thing with DK, though. If you get too close to that, make sure you be careful when you do power shots because. He, the Donkey Kong can easily throw the ball over the over the line here and force it to go out of bounds. Jeez, Toad, I'm not going to show you how it's done over close to the net because you're obviously not bailed out for the net. And he had a good run out there. His shot, his shots are pretty weird because they just have to go in a straight line somewhat. Oh wow! Oh man! If it's gonna be like this for Mushroom, imagine what's gonna be for Star Cup. We just gotta be very careful here. There we go. Okay, this is gonna be a quick match. There we go. That's how you do it, Toad. It's not going to keep you not build out for the net. Yeah. But anyways, in the finals, we're going to be facing the pr two princesses. Princess Daisy and Princess Peach. So, yeah. We got two princesses versus a monkey and a guy versus a guy in a mushroom hat. Let's move on. There you go, Toad. Seems like he can't get the ball away from the uh, his opponents. Like that right there, kinda. Looks like it's clo oh, close to Daisy, but it's enough for them to go for the other opponent not to return it. So, so yeah. Change 
Alright. Come on. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. No. Why did my voice change all of a sudden? Oh my god. Come on. Alright, there we go. Okay, I'm up to now. I'll show you how it's done, Toad. There you go. Set point. There we go. Hopefully Toad won't suck in the next two cups. Okay, but he's serving though. Nice. Nice one, Toad. But uh, DK, once you get used to the controls and Mario Tennis and how the how it works, I would recommend using the big power characters like Donkey Kong and Bowser. Because uh, I would stick to some of the like the speed and techniques before you move on to power. But I think a good power character to start out with would probably be Wario, because Wario is a darn good powerful character. Darn good power character. DK? Maybe kinda of hard to control a little bit. Because he is kind of slow, though. But until you master the controls of Mario Tennis, I will wait to use some of the big power characters like Bowser and Donkey Kong. See, I, like I said, I've, I've played Mario Tennis for 15 years now. <laughs> funny. That's funny right there. That wasn't funny, though. Daisy getting that power shot right there. There we go. Let's do this for the for the championship, guys. There we go. Donkey Kong and Toad take the Mushroom Cup. You know, I want to know one thing. Why would Donkey Kong and Toad ever team up? I mean, obviously they're here in Mario Tennis. Well, at this point, Donkey Kong Jr., which is DK's son, when he first time when he first playing as him, he's not unlocked. If you're playing him for the first time, obviously, though, I got him unlocked. But you guys get the picture. But anyways, there we go. That was uh, the Mushroom Cup. Now let's move on to the Flower Cup and see if we can take it to the, to these guys here. We're going to face in, well, we just got done facing Daisy, but this time she found a partner in Mario. You remember that Mario game for the original Game Boy? Where Mario rescues Daisy instead of like, Princess Peach? And at the end, it goes, oh, Daisy! Kind of weird, though. You guys know what I'm talking about, that old Super Mario game on the original Game Boy. There we go. Yeah, this this clay court could be a problem for Donkey Kong with his power and plus his slow speed. But I mean the ball, go yeah, because weak ball balance and slow ball speed. There we go. Hit Mario right in the face. He can take it like a man. He's been through. He's been through a lot. Talk about Mario. Plus Donkey Kong and Mario are kind of old rivals right there. We go back to the early, early, early days of both of these guys. <laughs> Mario stood there and took, stood there and took it like a man. That's what you gotta do. Stand there and take it like a man. See, my God, somebody call the freaking first aid. Get the first aid kit out here because Mario's gotta have a nosebleed. I mean, he has to because after all those shots, he. Took to the face, his nose has got to be bleeding. But no blood since this is an E rated game. Speaking of the other princess, Peach has also found herself another partner in Waluigi this time. Waluigi's also another character who's been making a lot of appearances in these tournaments. Same with Paratroopa. I have noticed. There we go. Oh, 
Come on. There we go. That's what I was wanting to do right there. So far, DK is doing pretty good on the clay court. I think he did pretty good last time. Just having Toto as a weird character because his straight his shots always stay straight most of the time. Alright, here we go. Another weird pairing. The pairing doesn't make any sense. Peach and Waluigi. Why would they team up? I don't know. Just like Donkey Kong and Toad. Okay. That's all I got to say. Ha <laughs> ha. Another quick one. Man, seems like almost every time we go to the second round of the tournament, we have really, really, really quick matches. Yeah, it's kind of odd though. I guess you could say, but anyways, Baby Mario and Yoshi did duo here to defend their Flower Cup title. Played these guys last time, so now we're going up against them as they defend their Flower Cup championship. But DK with the power shot right there to take to start things out with the bang. Oh wow! Charged up for too long, and the ball bounced too many times. There we go. Game point time. Yeah, that's the bad thing about trying to you power up your shot too long. It could be a could uh, spare trouble because if you power up your shot too long, you won't, the ball will always have its a uh, bounce where it um, counts as a point, as you saw a little while ago. There we go. So far, Flower Cup's not been that bad. We did kind of get off to a shaky start, but I think we got our groove now in the Mushroom Cup. I don't know what that was, but anyways. Heard something in the background. Yo! Baby Mario trying to do something, but oh god, that right there is a killer right there. That shot DK did, that's also a killer too. Surveys from Baby Mario. That wasn't over there in time. But I was there that time around. DK, Toad, take the first set. Not right, Toad. Okay, I was ready that time. They wasn't able to return it. But I was ready in there ready and waiting. As we do Total Annihilation once again. <laughs> See, DK is perfect for the net because he can easily return shots with a powerful shot of his own. Like that right there. That's enough where his opponents can't get to the ball in time. There we go. Whoa, that was good. I forgot. Well, I do. I didn't forget. I remembered that Yoshi had that powerful serve as well. Probably one of the best sir one of the best speed characters that has a good serve. Talking about Yoshi. I mean, he's just a good, good character to use in general. And wow, we actually kind of flew through the Flower Cup. Wish we could have done that for the Mushroom Cup, but I think we got our uh, leg in on it here. here. As DK and Toad celebrate. I'm gonna skip that. I'll probably skip most of the animations, maybe. Alright, Star Cup time. Let's we'll see if these guys can handle it. I know they can. Face Mario and Birdo right here. Man, this video's been full of weird parents. Now we got Mario and Birdo. And these two didn't even get along in the second Super Mario Bros. game. Not the uh, Lost Levels one, but talking about the Super Mario Bros. 2 that was only released in Japan. I'm talking about the Super Mario Bros. 2 version we got here in America. 
Those two never get along, and of course, if you classic Mario fans know, there's been some, con I don't want to say controversy, but something over Birdo's gender, whether it's, whether it's a guy or a girl. Man, I knew I was going to go out. Yeah, Birdo's, I think Birdo's a, a female here. Because look at the way she looks, and the way she sounds. That kind of sounds female-ish, don't you think? There we go. We're doing pretty good so far, but this is going to be still trouble out there as I get hit in the face. There we go. Sorry, Toad. I was going to take that one. You need to work on your shots, buddy. Okay, return it that time. Okay, let's finish this. Doing pretty good so far. Haven't ran into any trouble yet as we take it to Mario and Birdo. So yeah, we're doing a pretty good run. Okay, we got Wario Luigi here. Is that next? Next pair right here. And you know what? For the first time ever in a doubles tournament, we have not seen Koopa Paratroopa. So he's sitting out this time around. But, well actually I'll get to that discussion later. Not good prepared trip, but well, mainly next weekend because next weekend's gonna be a little bit different, and you'll see why once we get to the end here, and I'll, I'll explain it definitely. Okay, hey, Toad, this is your time to shine. There you go. That's what you're supposed to do when you're at the net. Make sure the ball goes away from your opponent. Ha <laughs> ha! Right into DK's playing field. And right into the Ouija's playing field that time around. Alright, you're doing pretty good. Ah, uh, no, not yet. Oh, wow, this could be trouble right here. Told you, idiot! Yeah, these guys could be a little player here. But we just, it's okay, we just gotta win two more games and we'll be okay. Okay, 2-1. Let's finish this. Alrighty, there we go. Match point. Okay, there we go. We got our groove back right there. Wario and Luigi tried, tried to uh, get one in over us, but nope, we got it. Oh, this ought to be a good match. We got Bowser and Yoshi here. So we got a power character and a speed character versus power and technique. Oh, what? Let me see that. Let me see that. How was that out? It was barely out. Kind of a small strike call out there. But Toad's gonna help me out here. Haha, <laughs> there we go. DK's pretty good. Return those power shots. Toad is too. He's getting better here. Despite that weird pairing, we're doing pretty good. Now comes the real test. We got Bowser serving. And here we go. Let's see how we're going to do this. DK handled it pretty good like it was nothing. Seems like DK can match up to Bowser here. As long as Toad doesn't do stuff like that, we should be fine. And Bowser doesn't do that. I forgot how much of a pain that was last video. 
shoot it down the middle. Okay, there you go, Toad. Alright, here we go. I knew that was gonna happen. I was there, they're waiting for him and kinda weird right there. Camera kinda shifted out. But it doesn't matter, we got the first set. Nope. So yeah, so far so good. Wasn't what I was expecting. I was expecting Bowser and Yoshi to give us a little bit more of a challenge, but kind of taking it to them right now. Wow, this is actually going pretty smooth in the last Star Cup match because Bowser and Peach gave us a run for our money last time. We even went to tiebreaker. That's how. That's how. That's how. Uh, I want to say difficult, but. I want to say annoying as well. I'm trying to figure out the word for it. I guess interesting. There we go. Finally hit it. Okay, Yoshi's going to be serving. He also has a good serve as well. But we're doing pretty good. Let's go. Let's do this thing, Toad. Came right to me. Played right in my hands out there. Ball coming right to me. Oh boy, is this gonna be this is gonna be quick. This must be the sh this may be the shortest Mario Tennis video that I've had in this project, maybe. But again, come on. Oh my God, this is only this is gonna be under 25 minutes. Wow. This I approve. I mean, it's a short video, but. Less upload upload time, but this is really good. DK and Toad. Okay, Perrin. Kind of weird there in the Mushroom Cup, but we took it to these guys as they celebrate with the Star Cup trophy. And I'm gonna wrap this thing up, guys. I'm actually gonna skip this since we've seen the animation already. Okay, guys. I know I was, I'm gonna do something pretty. We'll do something different for next weekend. I'm actually not gonna play as. Uh, Koopa Paratroopa and then going to DK Jr. like I did, like I'm doing now. I'm actually going to play as Donkey Kong Jr. next weekend. Because I still got to go through this singles run. And it, So here's what's going to happen. Saturday will be Donkey Kong Jr. singles run. and then Well, Saturday will be his uh, singles run. And then Sunday will be his doubles run. So you guys expect, so that's what's on the agenda next weekend. But in the meantime, guys, this is Geese 16 signing out. Later.